Hey guys, Adriano Persichetti from Mindjet Real Estate. Welcome to our latest Mandalay listing. Yes, another one in beautiful beverage. It's a fantastic four bed, two bath, two living zone, two car home with amazing views from your backyard, which I'm gonna show you in a little bit of time. Let's go check this home out, 259 Mandalay Circuit. I just wanna quickly start by showing you actually how cool this little spot is. So you're actually not on, now let's call it a main strip, even though it's not really a main strip of Mandalay Circuit, but you've actually got a nice little inlet here. Look at this little parking that you've got here. So it's quite private. You've got a few extra visitor spots here, which I think is really, really cool. And straight up Mandalay Circuit down the very end, which you're probably not gonna get in the camera, you get beautiful views, which you're gonna get from your uh, backyard as well. So let's go inside guys and check it out. So the first thing obviously you'll see, it's single fronted, it's a double car, obviously garage, remote control garage. It's beautiful and low maintenance, the grass here is impeccable. It's slowly coming back to life um, after the cold winter months. But again, it's very small, very low maintenance. Brick home, let's go through. So the first thing of course you'll see is fantastic, beautiful timber floor. So this actually goes right throughout the property which you will see. Master suite is the first thing I want you to see. Now here we go, one, two, welcome home guys. So this is your master suite. As you can see, it is a very spacious master suite. Beautiful views of your front garden. The other feature the vendors have installed, heating and cooling split system in the master. Now there is central heating through the house, but you do get your own split system, which I think is really, really cool. But again, very spacious, beautiful plush carpets, which I think are really awesome. Through here, we're gonna quickly show you. So you've got a, an actual, walk-in road with a door, which again, you're rare these days you get that, but again, plenty of hanging space, good storage space up the top, and then you come through this way into your master ensuite bathroom. This is what I love, it's quality. Stone bench tops, did not spare or skimp at all. Beautiful 20, 20 mil stone. His and hers vanities, which are raised, which I really, really love. Very classic look. Beautiful tap fitting there. Nice big mirror so that everyone can get involved. You can have three or four people getting uh, dressed and ready. I love the shower. Have a look at the shower. Double shower. Look at the size of that rain head. That's actually very similar to one that I've got at home, funnily enough. But fully tiled, I love the beautiful recess in there. Toilet tucked around the corner. You've got heat lamps in here as well because it does get a little bit cold in winter up here. Uh, in mandolin beverage, but again, it's a beautiful bathroom and sliding cavity door. So you've got your own privacy as well, which again, the owners have done that. You normally don't get that in homes these days, but they've done that, which is really, really cool. Come through here, guys. So you've got the double car garage. Now we're not gonna, obviously the owners are using that for a little bit of storage at the moment, but as you can see, it is remote control garage. It is a double garage. There is a door to the rear that takes you up the side of the house. We're gonna keep coming this way. I'm gonna whip you in there, George, just to show you the laundry. So it's a nice modern laundry. It's got a nice little tile splashback, which I love, but again, plenty of space. You've got the timber bench top as well, laminate timber bench top, nice big trough. You've got your utilities cupboard there, which has all your power and whatnot with the vacuums as such. And you've also got a nice big linen cupboard. As you can see, the vendors have done a beautiful job in presenting it very, very nicely there. Just through this way, there is, that's what I was telling you about. So there is a Brivas central heating unit throughout the house. The first of its living zones, guys. So there's two living zones in the house. This is the first of its living zones. This is the uh, modern theater room. Again, the guys haven't set it up as a theater room. However, and I'm just gonna quickly uh, get you to have a look up here. There are speakers, cables ready to run. So for surround sound, there's also HDMI cable up here. So if you're wanting to run a projector, it's HDMI ready, power ready to go. So you can easily convert this very, very easily into a theater room or it's your second living zone, kids play zone, whatever the case may be. Again, double sliding doors. So you can have some privacy. 
especially if hubby's having his friends over and the footy finals are on, which we're now out of. Come through this way, guys. So this is your open plan lounge at dining and kitchen. We'll start with the lounge. As you can see, it's a very spacious and very light-filled zone. Um, nice big windows. You actually get um, two blinds. You've got the block-out blind, and this is right throughout the house as well. And you also get the more privacy shade blind under here, which I'll roll out for you, as you can see. But again, the space is fantastic. Um, you could very much maneuver this around, but obviously the it has got some really nice furniture. Coming through this way to your dining zone, so obviously you've got a nice big Panasonic system. Again, heating and cooling. This will do pretty much the whole house. Um, you'll see that you obviously you saw the front one in the front bedroom, but this will do the rest of the house. You've got a fantastic dining zone. Have a look at this beautiful light that comes in to the dining zone. It's amazing. I'm going to take you out in a little bit, but again, big, nice, big eight-seater table here. Fits perfectly. Over through to your kitchen. So you've got your beautiful big 40 mil stone uh, island bench with breakfast bar, as you can see there. Nice big double sink in the middle, which I love. And I love the stone, the beautiful Caesar stone. Again, it's quality kitchen. You have your Westinghouse dishwasher through there, as you can see. Nice, beautiful Westinghouse dishwasher. You've got your fridge space through, through here. Westinghouse again. The owners love the Westinghouse. But again, you've got a nice big 900 mil cooker Westinghouse again. So Westinghouse appliances right through. Big five burner gas cooktop. Big, big oven. I love the glass splashback. This is my kind of modern um, look. It's great. It actually ties in with obviously the pendant lights over the... Um, over the island bench, but again, a fantastic space. I do want to take you outside. Not on, oh, the pantry. Good pick up. I forgot about the pantry. Walk in. Hello. Great cupboard space. There's power in here as well. So microwave, coffee machine, everything can be set up in here, which is great. Door on it as well, so you can close it away, especially if you've got families or it's not neat. But this is very, very neat. Thank you to the vendors for this. I want to take you outside, I normally don't do this, but I want to go this way because I just want you to check out this scenery that you get here. So you've got an undercover alfresco zone, which you can easily enclose if you really wanted to. So easily put cafe blinds down and close this section to make it a bigger space uh, from your dining zone. It's fully concreted up the side of the house. But the one thing that I want you to see, now we're getting to the stage uh, the vendor is very, uh, very, very, um, what's the word that I'm looking for? Loves his grass, okay? And he's really, really conscious about it still starting to pick up. But this grass is amazing. And I'll tell you now, I reckon in about four to six weeks time, green like you would see outside. But the views of the paddocks, this is what you're buying in Mandalay. This is what you're buying in this pocket of Mandalay. It's all privately owned farmland and beautiful rolling hills all the way, all the way up, all the way to the end. And this is what you get to see every single day. Won't be built up, well, there's no plans for it to be built up anytime soon. And again, it's a really great backyard, perfect for families with kids or dogs, as you can hear probably the dogs in the background. The owners have built a nice little bench seat here as well, again, with the planter boxes just to add to this beautiful uh, back zone. So again, it's an awesome backyard. You will love, I guarantee you, by the time this goes to market and sells, you'll be in here, hopefully by Christmas time of the new year, you'll get to be able to utilize this space. You'll love it. So that's the outside bit. We're gonna go and check out the other three bedrooms. And they're all over here. So bedroom number two and three, get beautiful views of that beautiful hill, paddock, farmland at the back there, which again is fantastic. The amount of natural light that comes in here, as you can see, is phenomenal. They are, they do come with built-in robes. So as you can see there, so they're double door built-in robes as well. But they're, it's got internet, so internet ca uh, connections in here as well, if you're wanting to set up a home office and whatnot. We come this way, it's a bedroom number three. Uh, and as you can see through here, another beautiful view 
Similar size bedroom, I would say almost the same. Mirror image, built-in robes again through here, as you can see, the light that comes in here. It's amazing, it's amazing. Through this way, obviously you've got the separate toilet. Through the left-hand side, you have the central bathroom. Not as big as the uh, ensuite actually, but still a fantastic luxe bathroom. Again, stone bench tops, very much mimicking the ensuite. You've got a fantastic deep bath. I just want you to check out the bath. It is perfect for those families with kids or after a long, hard day at work, uh, in the new COVID world, what more could you want than come have a glass of wine in the bath? That's a beautiful bath. And then you've got the fourth bedroom. We've jazzed this up as a nursery. Um, as you can see, the vendors do have a little baby, a little bubba. So again, this is perfect just to show you the space. And the room is a very good size room. It obviously doesn't have the views, a bit more private, doesn't have the views of the others. But again, really good size room. Both sets of blinds as well. You've got a big, now I'm pretty sure, not pretty sure it is. So this bed, this wardrobe is a lot bigger than the other two bedrooms. So you could even use this as bedroom number two if you wanted and have bedrooms three and four at the back or whichever way that you want to uh, maneuver it out. So that's it guys, that is the home. It is a magnificent family home here in the beautiful community of Mandalay in Beveridge. Um, a little bit about the community, if you haven't watched any of my videos before, it is a very tight-knit community here in, in Mandalay and Beveridge. It is the first stop to regional Victoria. So again, for those uh, times that we've had lockdowns and whatnot, perfect place. There's lots of people that are migrating up this way uh, from Metro Melbourne. Um, it is a very tight-knit community. It is very uh, family-oriented, kids-oriented. Um, obviously, it's a golf course estate, so there's an award-winning golf course up at Club Mandalay, Craig Parry uh, design golf course where there's the pro shop and whatnot as well. So you have all the, um, so you get all the um, niceties of living in a golf course estate. If you want to buy yourself a golf buggy, you can do that too, which I have shown you in some other videos. But again, it's a very tight-knit community, um, very family-friendly. Um, you're only about a seven-minute drive down the road to the new Merrifields, where you obviously you've got Coles and whatnot there at Donnybrook. You're only about a 10 minute drive up north to Wallen if you wanted to stick more regional. Very, very beautiful community up in Wallen as well, where lots of people obviously head up from Beveridge as well. Um, and it is amazing. Honestly, it's an amazing place to live. And again, the beauty of this home is those, those beautiful views at the back. You cannot replicate that. It really does feel like you're in the country, but not actually in the country. And you're only about... Uh, 35 to 40 minutes from Melbourne CBD. So again, it's an amazing home. It's definitely going to suit uh, a lot of first home buyers, young families, young professional couples that are looking at coming. Some downsizers as well. We've got lots of downsizers that are actually coming to the community as well that still want the space of a home, uh, but not sort of skimp too much on the land. So you get a, a nice little parcel of land. Um, and of course, the investor out there, the Mandalay State is doing some really good things and it's had some amazing growth. So it is going to target quite a wide range of demographics. So hopefully you've enjoyed this tour. As always, I'd love for you to like this post. I'd love for you to share it to your family and friends. More importantly, if you know someone that's interested, I always say, please tag them in this post. I promise they will get to see this before it hits the market. So follow us on Facebook, Instagram and YouTube. You'll be able to see all our videos, including this one as well. And of course, if you want any more information or you want to know what your home is worth in the current market, right across metropolitan Melbourne and regional, of course, feel free to contact me anytime on 0402 055 Thanks, guys. I hope you enjoyed the tour and I hope I look forward to seeing you on our open homes. Thanks a lot.